350.org gets its name for campaigning for 350 parts per million. 1.5 means we have to get back to 350 and yet we've already hit 400. So we don't have time to build the sort of global consensus that we are talking about as if we had the luxury of time. We do have consensus in the one place that we need it, and that's on the science. The science is crystal clear, 97, 98, even 99% of scientists have told us that the only scientists who haven't are those who are funded by the fossil fuel industries. So with that consensus, what I believe we really need is a powerful movement. And so how we build that movement is, to, is why I came to Tucson today, and I'm so thrilled to be here with you, because I think young people need to be at the vanguard of that movement. 70% of our fresh water and 90% of our ice is, in, is held in the ice pack on the continent of Antarctica. And one side of it is sliding into the ocean thanks to warmer water. And when that, that is going to happen, there's no question that it's going to happen. Doing at the moment is relying on technology. We think that in the future, technology will do the job. Like technology has enabled us also to deal with a number of problems. And now we think that the future generations will also do the same, which is highly uncertain. Moreover, we think that technology will also solve the problems which we are creating for them. That is irresponsible. 